Hey guys, this is Peter, and one of the most popular add-ons for all of Kodi is this one down at the bottom, YouTube. It's actually a program for Kodi. It's a plugin, you'll see, called YouTube, and it's used by many other add-ons. So it actually uses an API to access all of the YouTube resources, and that access API has a limit to it. It's actually a million views. So every day it resets but so many people are using Kodi and so many different add-ons are using it that that million gets used up some days and sometimes pretty quickly let me show you what I mean I'm gonna go into YouTube the application and uh, let's try looking for something that's popular right now it's a Sunday and there we go daily limit exceeded this quota will be set at midnight Pacific yeah alright we all know about this how do I fix it so there are a couple different ways to fix it, but there's only one way to fix it for sure. So uh, go here to settings, and we talked about going and changing the key on the key ring, but what we're going to do today is enable our own API key. That means you can watch up to a million videos a day with your own key and not run into any troubles. So you're going to need an API key, an API ID, and an API secret. Now where do you get all those? I'm going to show you. So uh, I went online and actually watched a bunch of other videos, and there was a lot of good ones out there, but nobody really made it simple. So there's my challenge. I'm going to make it simple so everyone can follow along. Uh, I'm going to put a link to the site you need to go to, and here I have in my notepad that link. So you should open up a notepad as well and put down these API key, API ID, and API secret, because you're going to need all those. And here's the link. I'm going to put it down below. Let's go and do it. So I'm going to go to Google. You have to be logged in, and I'm logged in as me. Perfect. Uh, paste and go. Here we are. So we're under Google APIs, and you're going to click right here next to it. It's probably going to say project or new project. I've already created some. But you're going to click on this plus sign for create a new project. And I'm going to do one with you, step you through it. We're going to call this my special API for Cody. There you go. Uh, now, look at this. It's already given us our first piece of information. It's called my special API for Cody. That's our, our project ID. All right, copy, create. All right, so there's our first piece of data, and that is the project ID, paste. We're going to need that later. All right, so next thing we're going to do now that we have our My Special API for Cody, if you have more than one project, make sure you're on the right project. There we are. It should read My Special API for Cody. Click on this YouTube Data API. All right, we need to enable it right there. Okay, that so far so good. Create cre credentials over here on the right hand side. Now you need to tell it what you're going to use it for. And it's okay to tell it that you're using it for Android and to access public data. It'll even work on my PC. I've tried it out. Believe it or not, you're almost done. Because when you click this, what credentials do I need? it gives us our last piece of data there you can just click this button and copy it let's go back to the sheet because that ape that's your API key it's also your secret key so let's go ahead and paste those in let's go back to Cody hey we're still on the same page so I'm gonna paste these two in first right here Boop. Control V is going to get me there. Otherwise, you're going to have to type it in. Sorry, there's no way around it. It's a long typer. I get it. Type it in there. Now we're going to go back and get our app ID. Now, luckily, my project name was so long. My special API for Cody actually is my project ID. If you have a shorter one, it throws in numbers and digits and all sorts of stuff. Copy. Going back here. Pasting in. There we go. One, two, three. Ta-da. Now, now if I click popular right now, 
Come on. Uh, it shows me actual data. And let's see. Here, I saw something that was in English. Well, Minecraft. Let's just click it and see what happens. All right. Wasn't exactly in English, but it shows you it's working now. We're not getting the error. Uh, it'll work on all sorts of things now. Here, let's go back and type in something. Here, we'll type for search. Peter C408, that's me. So here is all sorts of stuff. Well, just, well, just as, as I made, I the, made the statement, statement that... Perfect. So everything's working. That error is now officially gone. Make sure that you exit out. So, sorry, got to show you one more thing. Uh, doom, doom, video add-ons, down to YouTube. When you do, because someone's going to mess this up. When you click on API and you enter one, two, three, all your things, click on OK. If you don't click on OK, it won't be OK. It needs to remember that. Other people were saying you needed to sign in. You don't need to sign in. You just need to have all your API stuff there. You're good to go. Uh, hey, do me a favor and click like because I think this one's simpler and it's going to be uh, a lot a lot of help to a lot of people. This will help it rise to the top. So uh, click like if it helps out. And um, hey, guys, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.